a real special little case. <clears throat> it's called the 2x2 two two Identity Matrix, and a discussion of multiplying matrices would not be complete without talking about the Identity Matrix. There she is, right there. Very simple. We have diagonal ones, we have diagonal zeros, and it's kind of cool what she will do. Let's take her times this matrix right here. A, B, C, D. All right. Now, let's see what will happen when I multiply the identity 2 by 2 identity matrix times this matrix. All right. 1 times A is A. 0 times C is 0. So 0 plus A is just A. So in the product matrix, in this element spot right here, we'll have A. All right, let's see what will go in this spot. We'll take this row times this column. 1 times B is B. 0 times D is 0. B plus 0 is B. Here, we take this row times this column. We get 0 times A, which is 0, and 1 times C, which is C. And in like manner, 0 times B, which is 0, and 1 times D, which is D. So 0 plus D is D. So the identity matrix, when multiplied here by a point matrix or any other matrix that is a 2 by, it just gives you back what you're multiplying by. So it's called the identity matrix. It's like 1 is the identity, the multiplicative identity. Okay, We're multiplying here basically by a matrix that's equivalent to 1.